it's your boys come follow me on twitch the link is in the description boys we're gonna be playing madden 2k mud all that good stuff and fun and friendly games over there so make sure you boys go check out my twitch link in the description and let's get into this banger video yo what's good youtube welcome back to guys let them all way today boys look today man we want to be using one of my defenses i used to use last year but i'm about to get back to using it a little bit this year before the end of the year because so, it's the end of the year now might as well start using some of your favorite defenses that uh you know before ncaa 25 come out so make sure y'all make sure y'all go follow my twitch and hit that sub button ncaa content is about to start being game posted so make sure y'all stay ready for that and get ready okay go to the twitch link in the description and go follow me okay now we are in the i think the jets playbook jets defensive playbook guys not the offensive playbook but it's a defensive playbook and it has this formation it has a few good formation as nickel over as dime normal dollar three two and it has this formation double mug now double mug is one of those formations is like bro it's good but it's not that good but you can still use it okay now what you what i recommend is that if sometimes uh if you can put a lurker right here on this outside guy if not you can just leave a regular lineman right there i mean you can't if i recommend having one lurker but if you don't have one it's okay go ahead and uh use safeties in the box right here, but you can use linebackers like i always tell y'all 90 plus speed or have lurker or have lurk artists okay boys now what you're going to do is come out in this play right here nickel overload three and what you're going to do is go to your coach adjustments first have auto flip on off have uh by speed aggressive and then this is pretty much it this is all y'all boys want to have right here off by speed aggressive nickel overload three say they come on this play right here perfect play now what y'all boys want to do you see how this guy's blitzing off that left side which is the opposite side i have back that's what y'all boys want okay now what you're going to do is it's very simple the first way y'all can set this up is simply by uh go ahead and show blitz okay press y underneath rb guest pass and what you're going to do is a slant press left on your d-pad slant your line to the right okay so the side of db is on side of the, the side db slide it the opposite way okay and then what you're going to do is put this guy my boy miles gear in a hard flat shade underneath again and remember i always do on that uh opposite side which is the solo uh db side or solo receiver side i always put a deep half because if they do try to bomb your cover three they can't because it's a deep half on that side okay now watch right here wait for him to snap it boom boom watch the field watch the middle of the field and you see that db he gets and he gets there you know what i'm saying that's what y'all boys want so watch right here hold on snaps it boom now you see this guy this guy is just a blitzer he's not really you know what i'm saying he's just there to, just to throw your opponent off he, he don't know if he's in the zone he don't know if he's bluff blitzing he don't know if he's you know blitzing or whatever it is you know what i'm saying he don't your opponent don't know so you're blitzing him you see this guy he's blitzing your user which i should have blitzed my user a little bit so he can occupy his idler but y'all boys see right here this is the guy that's coming in free this guy is literally coming in free from the other side and that pressure is getting there now and everything else you boys see take away this um take away this guy right here now obviously i probably should have ran with this not gonna lie probably should have ran with this and then you see right here this guy he did get open and this dig route did get open but it got open late and that pressure got this remember we're blitzing when you blitz something's going to be open you literally you can't you can't forget something's going to be open when you're blitzing somebody okay now another thing is go ahead and show blitz okay slide your line to the right Y underneath rb guest pass now what you're going to do is you're going to disguise your blitz now i mean now you're going to set you're going to set do this blitz a little bit differently so what you're going to do is press put y i mean not y but lb and then hook curl put this uh but uh this guy that's blitzing through the middle x and a hard flat blitz your user rb gas pass and then what i did recognize right here that tight ends on the corner route so i'm going to go ahead and put b in the outside quarter i'm going to go ahead and press him so he can get to that uh i don't know why my uh deep out zone ko isn't over there but if you do throw that corner around the deep out zone ko will knock it out very very easily so watch right here just how y'all boys are going to see it rb gas pass once again wait for him to snap it watch it watch the flat you see a flat taking away everything is back yes perfect defense boys perfect perfect defense so watch right here watch this right here boys look at this so boom this is a screamer bro like th these guys are screaming like look right here so you see my use i blitzed them so i got two guys basically coming in free and you see right here my boy ronnie barber freebie literally coming in free and i probably should have shaded outside because i want this hard flat to go to right here all right that's what i want him to be at and usually right here i have a tall bb so like this guy right here uh what's his name 
What's my boy named Jabril Peppers? Usually don't be right here. I have a taller DB. So he, if they do try to throw this dig route right here, see the dig route, this can get intercepted underneath unless he high ball it, which most people don't do. And by the time he even try to throw that, y'all boys see. What y'all see? He's on the ground. Bro was literally on the ground fighting for his life, bro. Literally. And my user's coming back to the middle of the field. You don't want to throw on a 6-7 user. 6-7 users are, you know, you don't want to do that, okay? Now, if you just want to go all out blitz, bro, which is some people might want to do that. You know what I'm saying? You want to go all out blitz, go ahead and blitz this uh, B guy, which is your... Uh, your boy Miles Garrett, and if you are worried about that 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 um, that dig route, just just go ahead and basically manually flip the play. So what you're gonna do is put this guy in the deep zone, put this guy in a hook curl, so you don't have to worry about the flat route uh, like this. I'm gonna put him in a hook curl flat, shade him underneath. I'm gonna go ahead and use a Crowder RB guest pass, and I'm just gonna use it his whole left side. So I know this blitz is gonna come in eventually, but what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna use her everything that I need to. So obviously. Right there, that's a perfect example of I'm over adjusting. I'm doing too much. Not gonna lie to y'all boys. I'm doing entirely too much. But y'all boys get the picture. You can do whatever you need to do to adjust to how your opponent is doing. But remember, remember, this Blitz and DB guy is going to come in free. That's the guy you want to come in free. So you're going to do whatever you need to do to make sure he comes in free. So, uh, like I said, you can do whatever you want. Whatever you like to whatever you think you need to do to make him come in free. So you see. I'm going to go inside my line to the right. Like I said, I'm putting this guy in the hook curl this time and putting the other guy in the hard flat so he can't play that zig route. I mean, that dig route. Or instead of shading underneath, I can go ahead and press Y and stakes, protect the stakes. So that guy, he's going to go right to that the, uh, the 10 yard line and guard that uh, that end route. So watch right here. Flat taken away. Everything taken away. And if you try to throw that end route, y'all boys see that is bag. Literally bag. Literally bag, boy. So watch right here. Boom. See the curl route? That's bad. You see this guy right here? See this guy right here? This guy, Crowder, is really guarding both of these routes. And if he throw this as a mid zone KO, that's a knockout. You know what I'm saying? He try to throw this right here. That's going to be intercepted. Plus, my user's getting back there. And that pressure is also getting there. So, look right here, boys. Look right here. Hold on. Hold on. Boom. He's coming in free. Boom. Okay. Now, make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me, okay, boys? Go to the Patreon link in the description. Go to the Twitch link in the description. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace.